This evade update is invisible and may be the worst one we have ever seen. This will ultimately make trimping useless, with a few exceptions. Hey I'm Robtos Pro, I create weekly evade videos and today I will be looking into what makes this the worst evade update we have seen so far. Throughout this video I will be looking at which maps this update has affected and why it impacts the overall gameplay experience. Let's get up this roof right here so I can show you it. Oh, it's it's blocked off. Hmm, that's weird. Let's try get up this other roof. Oh, it's also blocked. You know what else is now blocked off? This balcony and construct, and this roof and cell of research. All the spots I've just mentioned used to be accessible, and I've even made videos showcasing them in the past, such as my first ever evade video, which revolved around trying to reach this roof by trimping in the station map. Come on, yes, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go. Or another video, which was a guide on how to reach this balcony and construct. You know what doesn't make sense with this update? The fact that not all roofs or high spots were blocked off. Here's what I mean. This spot up here in Drab is still accessible, and literally all the roofs and water towers and desert bus as well. There's just no consistency to this at all. Either all of them are blocked or none are. It doesn't make sense to block off these roofs and station while still being able to go on top of the water towers. Personally, I want all of them to be accessible. Taking a look through Evade's update logs, this is what I found. Fixed certain escapable out of bound spots in some maps. I am certain this is what added the invisible barriers. This is if the developers think these roof spots count as out of bounds. Personally, I don't think they do because you could legitimately trump up there and next spots could still teleport to you. So it doesn't seem like it's out of bounds. Or perhaps it's hidden additions. Who knows? Honestly, this update doesn't affect you if you've never thought about reaching these spots in the first place. But for other people who trimp or use grapple to reach these spots, it is now a problem since more are blocked off. The reason people trimp and evade is to mostly reach high spots in maps and it sucks when the developers all of a sudden block off some of them. In my previous video, I've briefly mentioned the invisible barriers. Where's the fun in using grapple when the developers block off many roofs with invisible barriers? Exactly, there's less fun in using grapple or trimping if most of the roofs you want to reach are blocked off. I first noticed the invisible barriers when I was playing the April Fool's event back when evade was called Invade, and I initially thought to myself that this must be part of Evade's April Fool's gimmick, where they changed the maps with some being harder to survive. For example, some maps had trains coming from all directions, which instantly killed you, and I thought that the blocked off roofs were to prevent you from avoiding the trains. Okay. Oh, why is that invisible? Ooh. Let's get up to safety, actually. Oh, wait, they blocked off the roof. I can't tell if... Oh, wait. Wait, uh, I think they just blocked off the roofs for the sake of this, um, the trains, so you can't avoid them. But after the April Fool's update concluded, the same invisible barriers were still there. So this makes me think the barriers were added on the March 28th update. In conclusion, some recent evade update has added invisible barriers to certain high spots and maps, making them inaccessible. The update affects specific maps such as Station, Cell of Research, Construct, and perhaps even more, but not others like Drab and Desert Bus. The lack of consistency in which spots are blocked off doesn't make sense. The impact on gameplay is mostly felt by players who trimp or use grapple, as they can no longer access some of the roofs they used to. Overall, this is the worst evade update I've seen so far, and it hinders the overall gameplay experience. Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching, subscribe for more evade videos, and see ya.